sticks. It almost sounds like it should be a joke because that's how dumb it is, but. They're actually good. Balls alarm. Let's count. Just like a, <clears throat> how many tubs of spicy hummus does Emma have in her refrigerator right now? Um, an elephant <laughs> just from like my imagination um like th it's crazy to me how not artistically inclined I am it blows my mind like my own father is an artist that is his passion in life, that is his job. He's my dad and like, that's what fucking happens when I try to draw. Like, I have no artistic instinct. Um, but I'm okay with that because I just enjoy like, you know, doodling things. Like it doesn't, I don't need to be good at it to do it. I have this massive box of colored pencils from when I um, I don't know, I think I bought these when I was taking art class in high school, and I still have them. Listen, I might not be great at drawing, but I enjoy the sensation of using colored pencils, so why not? Like, this is something I painted. It's not all about being good at things. I'm not good at drawing, I'm not good at painting, I'm not good at playing drums, but I like the sensation of doing it. I like doing it. I don't need to be good at it to enjoy it. but I enjoyed myself, so. I always decide to come to the beach the same day that I wash my hair. Like the first thing I did this morning was wash my hair. It's all clean, it's shiny, it looks gorgeous. I wouldn't maybe say it looks gorgeous. She's okay. She falls, she falls. Why is there fucking bugs on me? It's already August and I have not done shit. I've been watching people going on these tropical vacations and I'm not gonna lie, like I 
am jealous and it just hasn't felt like summer to me. But I think that also when you become an adult, unfortunately, I think summer kind of loses its meaning. If I see one more fucking person on my Instagram that has a smoothie that's in a pineapple or something, like I'm going to, f I'm gonna get in the water, but my hair is so clean right now. Like it doesn't look greasy or oily, but I am about to go in the ocean and pack my scalp with salt and sand and I don't care, but it is kind of sad. It's like, these are my final moments with my nice clean hair. I'm enjoying it, I'm enjoying it. The ocean does look delicious today though. Like it looks fucking delicious. Sometimes you look at the ocean and you're like, ugh, ugh not interested. A few days ago when I was at the beach, there was a tiger shark in the water. I mean, is that what it's called? There's some sort of harmless, harmless shark in the water. Supposedly they don't attack humans, but I'm like, okay, like maybe not usually, but like what if this time? Anyway, last time I was at the beach, there was a shark. So like, I mean, I definitely have a little bit more anxiety about getting in than normal. But supposedly the type of shark was harmless. I just have a hard time believing any sharks are harmless. I feel like with any shark, there's a chance that they're gonna think that your foot is a flounder or something, and then they're gonna wanna take a nibble. And I can't blame them. I'm in their habitat, I'm in their world. I'm walking into their house. So if they wanna take a little nibble out of my foot, I can't say anything. If somebody fucking came into my house uninvited and they looked like a jar of peanut butter, I would take a spoon to them and fucking I do not know why people don't like going to the beach when it's overcast because I think it's so much better. You don't have to wear sunglasses because it's like the clouds are protecting your eyes so you don't need to wear sunglasses. That's great. Recently I've been not able to stop eating strawberries. Like I can't stop eating them. I eat probably one carton a day, sometimes two. I think they're in season or something because I either that or my taste buds are evolving and now I just like have a special appreciation for strawberries, but they're so good right now. Also, ever since my strawberry obsession has started, I feel like my experience every day pooping is just like 10 times better. I've been extremely regular. few months back. Well, I actually, I was like platinum blonde for like eight months and I kept bleaching my hair over and over and over again. And my hair is relatively fragile. So eventually all hell broke loose and my hair basically got fried off. And in the back of my head, things got really fucked up because I lay down a lot. You know, the hairs in the back broke and got really short. And so now all the hairs in the back of my head are really short, as you can see and it makes things very awkward. Should I just like cut bangs while I'm at it? Like, oh 
Fuck, I, I think I'm making things worse. Okay, let's just stop. Let's stop. I kind of want to cut bangs. Stop. I've never cut my own hair before. I feel like it kind of went okay. If I keep doing touch-ups, I'm going to end up with no hair left. Okay, now we're doing bad things. Now we need to stop. No more of this. No more of this. Why, why can I not stop? Okay, I need to stop. I actually need to stop. This is getting bad. This is like out of control now. My hair is so short. Wait, I kind of like it though. Can it even fit in a ponytail? No, okay. Okay, should I just like cut bangs right now? Stop, don't, wait, what if I just did a little bit? Okay, but what if I did bangs, not like all the way, but like what if I just did a little, what's the worst that can happen? It grows back, my hair is already fucked up. No, that's ugly, okay. Okay. Okay, I actually need to fucking stop.